Praise the Lord, everyone, and thank you for joining me for an episode of God Speaks. Happy Wednesday to you all. I hope that your day is going well so far. Um, normally, I like to do these in the morning, but um, God works in mysterious ways, and it was meant to be uh, recorded at a later time. So I bless the Lord. Happy Wednesday. Um, keep pushing, keep trucking through, um, keep standing on the Word of God. Um, and today is normally a day that I talk about a woman in the Bible, but God has kind of laid something else upon my heart. And I want to share it just simply because um, it's come up a couple times and I, I just feel led to, to share this. And I typically um, have dreams and visions and I don't usually share them unless I have the okay so to speak, to release them. So in this particular dream, um, and before I get started, I'm going to just say a prayer too. So dear Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you for your goodness and your mercy, Lord. And we know, Father God, that you give interpretation. So Lord, I will not give my commentary, Lord, but I pray that each one will seek you, Father God, and that they would get clarity, that they would get revelation, Father God, in the name of Jesus. And Lord, I just pray, Father God, that your will will be done in each of our lives, Lord. And I thank you, Father God, that you give dreams oh God and you also give interpretation so may they seek you fully for it Father God in the mighty and precious name of Jesus may it be confirmation to some new to others Father God and direction for others so we give you all the praise and glory in Jesus Christ's name amen and amen so praise the Lord everyone um in this dream um I don't want to make the video super long but in this dream um, I was somewhere, um, I had the impression I was in New York. Now, I have not been to New York um, personally. Um, and if I have, I must have been a child. Like, I don't recall ever being in New York. But for some reason, I had the impression that I was in New York. And all of a sudden, these planes were flying in the air. And um, when they were flying in the air, um, I knew that they were Russian planes. I don't know how I knew that they were Russian planes. And I remember standing on the ground and then I kept saying that they're going to bomb us. They're going to bomb us in the dream. And people were just kind of like, no, they're our allies. No, they're not gonna do that. And, you know, making all these excuses why they weren't gonna do them. And then the bottom of the planes uh, kind of opened up and they were getting ready to release these bombs, but in the dream it wasn't the bombs that actually uh went off that destroyed a good portion of um n you know new york in that area it was something that came from underneath the ground like it was something on our own soil that came up and i remember in the dream saying detonators now i have not necessarily researched detonators or anything like that but whatever it was it was made to look as though Russia was releasing the bombs on us, but it came from the American soil. And I remember the Statue of Liberty was completely like covered in water, like like it, the water went up so high, it was like um, it was it was it was just like it covered the whole statue. Like there was not a part of her that I could see that was not surrounded by water and then after that there were little sprinkles of people who had survived this um i don't want to call it attack but had survived um this situation and i remember in the dream thinking to myself oh you know like what is that now that is basically the dream and like i said in all things take it to god he'll give revelation he'll give clarity on these things but um this came up a couple weeks ago and then me and my sister had a conversation last night and when we had the conversation the dream came back to me so i just ask that you guys seek god for clarity and revelation if this is confirmation to a dream you had or a similar dream you had please share in the comments um and uh, again, take it to God for interpretation. But I felt, uh, I felt to release this and I wasn't going to do it this morning. I recorded a whole nother video and that video did not come out well. So that's why I'm recording at my lunch break because I do want to be obedient. I don't like, I, I get dreams a lot and um, visions, but I don't like to necessarily share them 
um, and I'm not putting dates and timing and all of that type of stuff on this because I don't feel led to God has not given me the okay to release anything of that nature but I will just say seek the Lord in regards to the dream and then just um, seek him in regards to your own dreams and vision because God do talk to us through dreams and visions and sometimes their direction and warning and different things of that nature so I just pray that um, if you have questions um, there is an email that you can uh, email um, email God speaks at uh, in the description or in the about session um, and then we'll just see what the Lord says but at least you'll have some idea um, you know I it's I'm trying to restrain what it is that um, I'm I'm saying I want to be very cautious of not only time but also what I release so in that case I will leave it right there and I know that you guys will seek the Lord be blessed in all things in Jesus name amen